March 2nd, today is Texas yes. Independence Day, and all around these Texas communities are celebrating. As they should be. <laughs> KDK's Tori Bean visiting Rust for this very special event. Tori. Neil, Sarah, Cherokee County came together to celebrate the 186th anniversary of Texas Independence at the Square in Rusk. The Historical Commission put together the event that went off with a bang. Fire. Shamrock Cleaver has lived in Cherokee County his whole life. At 87, he is blessed to be able to be part of the program. I've been blessed by the Lord being where I can talk to people and and relate stories and I've done a lot of stories for uh, schools and churches and stuff about Cherokee County and history and I've been blessed to have a good life. I'm 87, so I'm glad to be here. Cleaver is part of the Cherokee Rangers. The Colonel, as he is known along with his fellow Rangers, dressed in period clothing. Each of the nine members stood to remember soldiers of the Texas Revolution. And I'm so glad that we have this ceremony here every year, not to let people forget that Texas is, was an independent country when we declared our independence from uh, Mexico. Live music, a roll call of 100 confirmed veterans from Cherokee County and surrounding areas, and even muskets being shot are what you could see here on the square in Russ County. The things that happened uh, during the Texas independence, we need to celebrate that. We wouldn't, we wouldn't, we wouldn't be standing here as a free state, you know, a free country, you know, if it, so people need to really celebrate Texas Independence Day, I think. Christian country recording artist Michael Knight sang his heart out with Texas pride. I'm raised here. I'm raised in Russ, Texas. I was raised in Cherokee County. Man, it's just, I want to give back, you know. Shamrock Cleaver hopes Cherokee County will continue their Texas Independence celebration for years to come. The eyes of Texas are upon you and don't mess with Texas. The Cherokee Historical Commission holds several events throughout the year, so if you miss this celebration, definitely catch the next. In studio, Tori Bean, K2K News.